ladies and gentlemen, the 2024 Prevo H345. It almost looks like an MCI up front. I don't know, are you guys getting that vibe? <laughs> Thanks, Dennis. Ladies and gentlemen, it's 2024 Prevo Thank you. Okay, let's go around the coach and see uh, what it looks like. Check out the new driver window. Oh, look at that mirror. You guys, uh, you guys seeing that mirror over there? That's a camera mirror, and then there's a real mirror. Yeah, the luggage bay doors remain the same. They don't look like they've changed much. Not, notice, not noticing much. So the one thing I'm noticing that's different on the side is the front passenger window. Instead of a sharp drop down, look how it's angled. It's angled with, uh, I, I like that. It's more sleek. Again, it, there's a very much MCI J element to the whole slant of this, right? I mean, you guys seeing that? That just reminds me of MCI. Hey, how are you? It's Shamrock Sean, guys. You're live on Facebook. Uh, you're live on YouTube. <laughs> what do you think? I love it. Pretty sleek, huh? I think it answers a lot of uh, a lot of questions. Are you picking up what I'm picking up? It's got a bit of a J feel, MCI feel from the front. I hate to. Ins I'm not. I don't know if that's an insult or what. I like it. I did not say that on the road. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go look at the. Let's go look at the back. Hello. Yeah, make sure you get this right here. That's the aerodynamics. Oh, oh look at right look, look at the little uh, notch that's taken out. That's aerodynamics. <laughs> and it kind of sticks out like a fin. Let me move back a little. I don't want to. You guys see the fin? The back is completely redesigned. There's that entire arch that kind of sticks out. It's like a it's like a fin. How you doing? Oops, I'm sorry. This is Dennis. He's been my cameraman all afternoon. Thank you, Dennis. Appreciate you manning the cameras. Back to the uh, passenger side. You can't see the fin? I'm sorry. Let's go look at the fin again. You guys see how it just sticks out back here a little bit? All the way from that notch? Kind of sticks out. You guys will see. Oh, this guy's opening the engine hatch. All right. Optimized for the driving experience. Oh. Well, that's pretty much. I don't see. I don't see much difference in the engine. It's pretty much uh, the same as. Okay guys, I really want to show you the inside of this thing, but if you guys can see, there is a madhouse up there with people uh, trying to get in. So I'm going to let that die down a little bit. I know this, this live stream has gone a little long. I hope you guys uh, aren't getting tired of it. Um, but this will also be on my upcoming vlog of my visit to UMA. But yeah, I really want to show you guys the inside. I want to see the inside for myself. Is it good enough for you? It's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Look at all the people asking questions and commenting. <laughs> You're live right now. This is the president of Prevo, Francois Tremblay, live on Motor Coach World. Thank you so much. 
What a beautiful machine. You haven't seen that thing yet. Go take a look inside. I can't wait. I'm waiting for the... I don't want to trample any or get trampled. <laughs> hey, I, I haven't been on there yet. A lot of people are asking, did you redesign the cup holder? <laughs> I'm getting a lot of laughs, guys. This is for you guys from the president of Prevo. Did you guys redesign the cup holder? We want to keep some news for the next generation. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> we'll have to see. We'll have to see if the cup holder has been changed. What's up, Jack? Live on YouTube. I haven't been on the inside yet, but the outside looks sharp. Hi, Kenny. Hey, how are you? You purchased this? Didn't we get two? We got two of them coming. I got, we got two too, but okay. this one that I... Oh, this is yours. Same color, yeah. Is this your bus here? So this this bus on display, guys, this gentleman purchased. Dave Huang from Canyon Coach Lines, Las Vegas, Nevada. So if, if I accidentally get my fingerprints on it, you're not going to get mad, right? No, you want to Yeah, we have it. I'm trying to get you guys on board, but there's this huge line, so I don't know how the people that's gotten on board is going to get off. I don't know how they're going to get off because we're kind of creating a traffic jam here. Right off the bat, I like that the door got padded here. I like, this is kind of new. Okay, here we go. Hello, how are you? Oh, this is sharp, this is sharp. This, you did away with the glove, is that the glove, the glove box? Still? Is that the glove box? You did away with the, the big square glove box. Okay. <laughs> I think this, oh, here's a small glove box. Here's the dash, can I sit on here? Are we, uh, am I in line? Are you guys in line to sit here? Are you sure? I don't want to cut. Okay, all right, I'll sit. Asian drivers have a really bad reputation, so don't don't be afraid that I'm sitting here. <laughs> okay, guys. I am sitting on the dash. How's that? Of the No, it's all good. Here's the dash. There's no personal bubbles here tonight. Are you sure? I don't want to touch. Okay. Here, the driver's window is kind of redesigned. I like the electronic mirror. The buttons have changed to uh, different. Uh, You see this on your YouTube channel. Oh yeah, it's live right now. Oh, We're live. Hi James Henry, Canada. Uh, Candy's Coach Works. Candy's Coach Works, Grainsville, Florida. Yeah, nice yeah. to meet you, sir. You're yeah. live on YouTube. Yes, sir. Anything for the uh, YouTube crowd? Hey man, this bus is beautiful. <laughs> it sure is. <laughs> uh, I don't want to hog the driver's seat too long, so if anyone wants in, just let me know. I'll, I'll, I'll get off. But... I'll check it out. Okay, all right. <laughs> I won't be shy, man. Oops. We got too many uh, cords. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. All right, I'll let you by and uh, I'll, oops, I'm sorry. I'll squeeze in here and I'll let you off. As you guys can see, it is so packed in here. I hope nobody minds being on YouTube right now. <laughs> if you want, give your company a shout out. I got uh, a thousand people watching. Napa way. <laughs> Tornado bus from Dallas, Texas. Oh, I see your bus everywhere. Tornado. Yeah, you guys are a sharp looking bus. I like the yellow. 
Yeah. Like the yellow. I think it'd look on this one. Yeah, yeah I think it'd look great. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> You're on YouTube. What's your bus, bus company name? Superbus. Superbus from Brooklyn. All right. Okay, let's move further back. I like the seats. The seats have been redesigned. Each seat has a nice Prevo logo. Um, it's metal. I think it's metal. I'm going to turn on the lights for you guys. This is metal. Hey, good to see you, buddy. Hey, what's your video? Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. What's your name? John, John from uh, Tornado Bus Company. Tornado Bus Company, John. I like the yellow. Yeah, sharp, yeah. very sharp. Very sharp, right, very bright. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. How you doing? Good, good. Okay, guys, so obviously there's a lot of people on board right now, a lot of curious uh, folks want to check out the new Prevo. Once there's enough room, we're going to check out the restroom. Uh, I don't know if you guys saw the cup holders. I think they did redesign the cup holders. Many of you complain about the bad cup holders on the Prevo. Um, I think you'll have better luck now with this new design. Uh, yes, there's a lot of nice driver visibility. Uh, Kerwin May, Tim Phillips, new cup holder on the left side. That's right. Uh, John, Chris John says, beautiful. I've got to go, James. All right, JD Carr, thank you. Thank you for coming along. Walter Wells, we have to toss in our new Prevo coaches. They're, they're, we have those in our new Prevo coaches. All right, so we're going to wait. Line's almost gone. We're going to move back and check out the bathroom. All right. Thank you, William. William's making some room for me. <laughs> Will Scully, and where are you from? Scully LLC. Freedom Excursion. Nice to meet you, sir. How many? How big is your fleet? Eight. Nice. Very nice. Hi, Roy. How are you, sir? Nice to meet you. Beautiful bus. Got a lot of people asking questions. Lighting is nice. Someone says too pretty for Greyhound. <laughs> Tim Phillips says it's too pretty for Greyhound. <laughs> Give, tell them, give about two months. It'll give give about two months? It'll, it'll fit right in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Waiting to get back there. Beautiful seats. Okay, thank you, thank you. Still waiting for the crowd to clear. <laughs> Single set of wipers, yeah. We have about, I don't know, 20. Okay, here we go. Thank you so much. Absolutely, keep up the good work. <laughs> Thank you, I appreciate it. Appreciate yes, it. Take care of my people. Thank you. <laughs> um, the luggage bays are, are redesigned, I think. Um, well, I don't know. I think. It was like a little fan thing up here, maybe? Okay, restroom is the regular Prevo restroom. Nothing much has changed in the restroom. Hey, guys. Restroom is pretty, pretty much the same. But looking from the back to the front, oh, they got the, there's the, there's the clock on the very front. The digital clock has moved to the front of the bus. I like it. That's a nice place for it. Here, I'll let you buy. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, hanging out. Oh, here's the owner of the bus. This is the owner, Dave Huang. He owns this bus, so I'm trying not to dirty it up. <laughs> wow. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's a marquee. Okay, that's a marquee. And there's the clock. Lots of. Uh, Gadgets up here where they 
usually are. But oops, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Hey Ebro, come on by. But if you look down there, the cup holder, there's no more cup holder on the right side, right? If you push on that, that is that that's just a drawer, right? I think there's a lock. Okay, there you go. There's the oh, and in the drawer, there's a power outlet, there's a three millimeter mic and USB. Wow, two USBs and a three millimeter mic. That is cool. But the cup holder is no longer there. The cup holder is now there, and it's much deeper. It's no longer a weird, odd shape. I think that'll fit a lot of different uh, thermoses and stuff. And then there's a big box back here for drivers to put stuff in. You can lift the glare shield up on the dash. It looks like it's its own separate panel. I'll uh, make room for people here. Check out the glare shield. It looks like you can lift this up and uh, do something with it. I don't know what the function of that is. But, uh, oh, there's a lock. I think there's a lock right there you have to. So I'll let you buy and I'm gonna get out and I'll, I'll make room for, for more people. How's that? All right, how you doing, sir? Good, thank you. Beautiful bus, Good beautiful bus. Again, you, you too, hey, thank, your videos. thank you so much. Thank What's you your name, Mike? Mike Fitzgerald. Mike Fitzgerald. Yeah. Fitzgerald, you're live on YouTube from Fitzgerald Brothers Bus Co. from Geneva, New York. Yeah, I love your nice videos. to meet you, Keep Mike. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys, this is the brand new H345. It's 2024 model, so we got another year or so before. Uh, the height, I believe, is still 12.4. Uh, let's ask the president, uh, Francois, still right next to us. Is this Prevo still 12 feet, 4 inches? Yeah, the, the height is the, the height, same. Yeah, height yeah, is the yeah, same. Yeah, yeah. Height is the same. Yeah. So to answer your question, the height is the same, uh, Dondi. 12 feet, 4 uh, is the, still the height of the Prevo. Can you show the stairwell? Yeah, I'll show the stairwell again. The traffic has cleared. Um, here's the stairwell. It, the stairwell hasn't changed much, but the side of the coach has, the side of the stairwell. The door definitely changed. I love that it's not just a bulky square uh, plastic mold. There's actually a nice pad design on the stairwell, on the door. Rectangular section on the dash could be collision warning light, could be, yeah, I'm not going. I already been up there, yep. Welcome aboard. <laughs> okay, the stairs, here's the stairwell. Everything's pretty much... The stairwell has definitely been redesigned as far as the left and right side. Um, And luggage bays. Okay, we'll take a look at the luggage bays. This one's locked. They're all locked. Okay, so we can't we can't see the luggage bays. Any chance we can unlock them? I got I got about a thousand people right now live on YouTube that wants to see the luggage bays. I, we're live on YouTube right now. I have about hundreds of people that want to see the luggage bays of the new Prevo. You think it made that happen? I think somebody hit the switch. Yeah, somebody hit the okay. switch. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe yell up there, have someone hit the unlock. Oh, you got keys. Actually, I think I got it. We talked to the right person here. All right, thank you so much. What was your name? My name is Tommy. Tommy and Nolan. Thank you, Tommy. Here's the luggage bay. It's very clean. Pretty much the same as the original Prevo luggage bay. It doesn't have the what? That's right. The bar, the crossbar. Yeah. Okay, so you guys, I don't know if you guys noticed this. No longer has the crossbar. Thanks for pointing that out. Oh, yeah. Sean Ayers yeah, from, from Maple uh, Way Coach Apple LLC Apple Columbia. Coach. Sleeper, uh, sleeper, sleeper coaches. Yeah. Awesome, yeah. awesome. You're live on YouTube. Hello, everybody. All right, so the uh, luggage bay is pretty nice. Yeah, I love that there's no more crossbar. The one thing about Prevo uh, that everybody loves is the huge amount of luggage space. And it, it's uh, retained that. Handicap, yep, it is handicap equipped. Open or closed bays are an option. I don't know. Um, we have both at Village. Hi, how are you doing, folks? Okay, guys. Um, ADA boarding, ADA is right here. 
This is the ADA door right here, uh, and the ADA, that's pretty much the same um, as it was before. So, haven't seen the 2003 of my company. Folks, uh, it's been a long stream, but I'm gonna end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, the brand new 2024 Prevo H345. Stay tuned for my entire video and experience here at UMA 2023 uh, in Orlando, Florida. There's a lot of, lot of stuff to see. This is super exciting. And what's that? Oh, I have to move. I'm standing in someone's shot. I'm gonna move. So we'll call it here, guys. Thanks for tuning in. I really appreciate you guys being here. And as always, if you're watching this, you are part of the motor coach world. Thanks everyone, have a great day.